Hello and welcome to HD Auto. Today's episode is a bit more special because it's definitely more green. And that is because we have the Ola Electric S1 Pro scooter with us. You've seen this electric scooter in photos, you've seen it in promo videos as well. But today we'll be telling you what you need to know about this latest product to hit the Indian market. This is HD Auto, I'm Shubhadeep. Stay tuned. Ola S1 has a compact dimension, a more rounded design style and a very Disney wall like LED headlight unit. Multiple color options and matte and gloss choices add to the distinct character. My choice was this understated matte grey for our short ride. There is a single stand on the left of the scooter's body, a relatively wide seat, twin speakers, yes speakers, on the inside of the front frame, a hook for shopping bags and even a USB point for phone charging. The phone can be stored behind the speaker units, although large phones may not fit. I also didn't quite like the single channel running through the footbed because I won't be able to plonk extra shopping bags between my feet. But you can forget about flipping out keys if your hands are full of bags because the Ola S1 or the S1 Pro that you see here is all about tech and can be controlled either via the large display screen or even a dedicated app. Even the boot has no latch and needs screen taps and flicks to open or lock shut. This is easily one of the biggest storage spaces in two-wheeler space and can fit two conventional helmets or a helmet and this Ola home wall charging set easily. The charging point can be plugged into any wall unit for a top up. But the central attraction though is the screen right here. Large, bright, vivid and responsive to touch, well almost anyway. This is the headquarter for everything Ola S1 offers. We tried the Bluetooth connection for audio, the navigation and tinkered with the settings. The Android based OS was a breeze to use. Remember, you will even get custom modes via OTA updates for varying display and sound choices, but this at a later stage. But this here is after all a scooter, best experienced on the move, so it was soon time to ride out. The S1 Pro is the upper variant and I had this particular unit and it was super duper silent even by EV standards. It also has a reassuring weight and in normal mode managed to get a move along quite well. Want some more fun? The sport mode is terrific. The hyper mode is terrifying. Terrifyingly good. Turn the throttle and the instant rush is just brilliant. I managed to hit 90 kmph in no time at all and was quite impressed with the steady character of this scooter. The single fork front and mono suspension at rear seemed par for the course but will require more testing. But the disc brakes are spot on with great stopping power. While there still is a whole lot to discover and experience in the S1 and S1 Pro, in my short ride, this scooter did leave me wanting for more. It's been a short but good fun ride with the Ola S1 Pro. The electric scooter does marry technology with mobility and does it quite well. But will it actually bring about a revolution in the Indian EV space? Time will have to tell. For now though, it's a good option to consider in case you're planning to go electric. How did you like this video? Do let us know in this episode. That's all we have for you today.